thank you very much. First of all, I do apologize because I know you were all expecting Mr. Antonello Camisecra, the CEO of Anna Green Power, so I'm actually an LB plan today. <laughs> the first one, I think. So, <laughs> but I'm very happy to be here with you because uh, I am a part of this story. Uh, the story of Enel. Enel is a utility, actually is the second largest utility in Europe, operating in 37 different countries, uh, five continents all over. And uh, Enel Green Power was born in 2008, late 2008, and the idea at that time uh, was, um, let's say, um, working together, guided by a very visionary man, Mr. Francesco Starace, that was leading that small renewable company inside the huge Henel Group. At that time, the renewable net installed capacity, 2008, was around 2.5 gigawatts, mostly on hydro and few solar, and the most in Italy. The challenge was uh, to let spread and uh, go and uh, conquer the so-called emerging markets. But we soon understood that the, the, the so-called and old model of the corporate social responsibility was unfit to the goals and the purpose we had. And that's part of my story because we start studying and implementing our way of creating shared value, changing completely and affecting our value chain. And right after the process and the organization, and so far we did a lot. It's a journey, as many of you said this morning, we are on the path, it's not finished. The path is very long, sometimes it's also very strong and tough, but we are doing it. And what happened later on uh, is that, uh, uh, for sure, in 2010, Enel Green Power was listed in, in Milan and uh, in Spain, in Madrid. But in 2014, that visionary guy uh, took the edge of the Enel Group and he decided later on to incorporate the Enel Green Power Renewable Unit into the group, into the ANA group, and now we are reshaping all the strategy and the business model of the company. This is exactly what happened. Um, no one in those years, I'm talking about at the beginning, the first uh, year of 2000s, could bet a dime, let's say, in uh, renewables. That market was very small. Now we are talking about a market that closed 2017 with 300 billion euro investment only in 2017. And there are more or less uh, nearly 90% of the net new installed capacity in Europe is done by renewable energy. And now there are more than 9 million people globally working in the energy renewable sector. So this is just to introduce the new CEO of Energy Green Power, Mr. Antonello Camisecra, that at that time was leading the business development unit within Energy Green Power. Thanks. Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. Let me start by apologizing for the impossibility to be present physically in uh, this initiative. I will start introducing Enel Green Power. Uh, Enel Green Power was incorporated in 2008, uh, merging the assets of the Enel Group uh, in Spain, mainly in Spain and Italy, uh, mainly Hydro at that time. And since 2008, we have been very far uh, becoming today one of the global leader in renewable energy. Enel Green Power today is present in more than 30 countries, Italy, Spain, Europe, Africa, United States, Canada, Latin America, Asia, and more recently, Australia. Today we are in more than 30 countries with more than 40 gigawatt of renewable capacity in uh, all the mature renewable technologies like hydro, geothermal, wind, solar, and biomass. 
Enel Green Power started from the beginning of uh, its history working under the concept of uh, creating share value and we can say that today we have uh, the concept of creating share value fully embedded in, in the entire value chain from development to construction to operation from suppliers to customers all our activity includes the concepts of uh, creating share value. An example of this is, for example, the sustainable construction site concept, which means that when we open a site to build physically, build a plant, we analyze before, uh, during the development phase, all the needs of the local stakeholders, and we try to mitigate impact that we create during the construction phase, ideally to bring this down to zero. We can do this in a number of different ways, by creating uh, uh, small, medium enterprises, by minimizing the pollution and the impact, the usage of diesel, for example, during the uh, construction phase for the needs of the construction site itself. Uh, we install uh, uh, renewable plants uh, to supply uh, the workers and the machineries that we use during the construction. This may be done with the solar panels or with more complex systems like uh, uh, hydrogen-based uh, storage systems like we did in Cerro Pabellon in the Andes. Sustainable construction sites is one of our pillars of sustainability and of course we are applying this concept also in uh, the case of our Bangala project, a PV solar um, project that we're building uh, in Australia, in South Australia. There, the core concept of sustainability is the valorization of, of Aboriginal cultural heritages. We're working together with local organization to valorize the local culture and engaging with local communities to really share values that we are creating by the construction and then future operation of uh, this power plant. Being renewable not necessarily means being sustainable. Enel Green Power has a very clear concept in uh, this regard, so we are working with our clients and our suppliers to spread the concept of renewability and move towards the concept of sustainability. The sustainability of our construction sites is just one of the examples. We try to be sustainable the entire value chain from development, construction to operations and in the interaction of, with our suppliers. More and more customers, commercial and industrial large consumers are moving towards renewable energy because this represents for um, large enterprises a, one of the central solutions to improve the sustainability of their business. With Enel Green Power you can achieve more because we are not only renewable but we put sustainability at the center of our value proposition, uh, letting our customer participating to the uh, broad approach that we have around sustainability. So Enel Green Power Energy is sustainable renewable energy. One of the most critical social issues that we face uh, during our presence in a territory and specifically during the construction phase is the creation of uh, jobs, of local jobs, which is uh, one of the, our most important uh, uh, topic when we analyze the possibility to share value uh, from our project to the communities that are hosting us. Uh, just an example, 90% of the workforce during the construction site is locally supplied locally from local manpower and normally we retain a number of people during the entire technical life of the plant working as professional skilled uh, technicians in the operation and maintenance of our plant. I wish you a fruitful discussion during the next days around the concept of sustainability which I said are at the center of NL Green Power value proposition.